As I look at what we've done with this engine as a team, I'm very proud of what the entire organization has done in coming together in developing a product that I believe will be second to none. This plant is a V-twin focus factory. We make a lot of V-twins here and we took advantage of our focus factory footprint here and looked at this commercial opportunity to basically say, you know, this 810 fits right in our sweet spot of our competencies of this plant. That 810 was given a lot of thought and consideration. It will be our first domestic commercial engine plant. So all the advantages of having a facility in North America for our North American customers, quick shipments, quick turnaround. This facility had the space. It's part of the family, product focus family. So perfect fit for us here in Auburn. Obviously this is a Vanguard product. Vanguard tolerances, Vanguard designs. We took all that into account. You know, as you come through the process and get into the assembly area, we have taken a very specialized approach to how we assemble these engines. It's a kind of a craftsman approach. It's not a mass uh, produce process and that's what the commercial engine customer really expects these things reliability durability we know what they expect and we're here to meet those criteria and build them a great product and you know when we walk through the assembly line we have taken the process from front to back and then we said for the requirements to work on this line we want you to go out and get this master service technicians uh, certification and these folks are talented in hydraulics pneumatics industrial controls they are our top guns in our manufacturing operations. We want to create a relationship between the technician and the engine that they have assembled and packed in the box. That's their engine, they're proud of it. Um, they're going to be connected to the customer. And we think that that relationship and the pride that they have, their skills that they have, they're going to knock it out of the park. This is going to be a product that we're going to be very proud of, our customers are going to love, and you know, uh, we got a process set up around that. So when we began this process, we really had to contrast back to what we do in traditional manufacturing here at Briggs. This line had to be a little bit different. We wanted to have an all-encompassing team uh, of technicians, and that's really a self-directed work team. They take ownership of it from start to finish, and we recruited the best. Combined, the three that we chose have 35 years of professional engine experience. Well, we begin the process with our CNC machines, our turning centers. Those are state-of-the-art, really the first of their kind here at our plant. We'll use CMM gauging to inspect uh, the parts when they come off of those. Throughout the line, we've got a lot of DC systems. You go from your, your air tools, which were the, really the way of the past, where you just torque down a bolt and you have to check it after the fact. All of our DC controls throughout the system, they go through and, and they'll torque. They're very accurate, they're very repeatable, they're very durable. Every single torque that's, that's put onto a bolt will be captured and data logged and cataloged and tied back to the serial number of that engine. We'll do our error proofing. Uh, you'll do a torque to turn on the engine so you'll validate uh, that all your features are put in properly and then you'll power test the engine. It's absolutely rewarding that we're going to be building engines that are going to be out there, they're going to last thousands of hours, they're going to they're be built right here in Auburn, right here at Bridge and Stratton. One thing that really makes me feel proud and confident of this engine is how holistic the approach has been to manufacturing. At Auburn, Alabama, we've got the right people and we've got the right process going into the combination of building this product.